Graduation is a time of joy and celebration. There is a heartfelt thankfulness for the seeds that were planted many years ago and carefully nurtured. Our parents and families have sheltered, loved, and provided for us. Our teachers have watered us with the knowledge we need to survive the weather of life. They taught us multiplication tables and how to read. Our stems grew stronger as we transitioned from being dropped off on the first day of first grade to taking our first steps into the high school as seniors ready to rule the school. Our coaches have challenged and cheered us on to achieve more. Our mentors have listened carefully and encouraged our thinking. We have been blessed with much care and are thankful for this watch watchfulness. Now our roots have been established and there is a hopefulness for what is yet to bloom. Much like when I plant seeds in my garden, there is a time when we are all excited to see the flower that has emerged. The class of 2020 is going to unfold into a sea of bright colors and patterns that will be a unique field. Some of us may have a path that is well planned out, while others may still be pondering their next steps, and that's okay. With perseverance, we will all achieve our individual goals. Our futures as scientists, artists, educators, politicians, doctors, and many more are as critical as ever to improve society with our unique imprint. I am thankful for the variety of talents I see among my peers. I appreciate the future authors who will scribe books I, I will find myself enjoying, but would never be able to write myself. I cherish the future musicians who will fill our ears with good vibes, the chefs who will tempt our palates, the mechanics who will keep our endless quest for automation running smoothly, the healthcare workers who will protect our health and well-being, and the programmers who will design the next beloved video game. Yet, our careers are just one aspect of who we will become. We will cherish our childhood friends, but can look forward to forming many new friendships, as well as becoming parents, aunts or uncles, or grandparents. The transition from high school out into the world is always uncertain, but this year more than ever. Many things that once seemed certain are now not a given. When I thought my family would be watching March Madness, we found ourselves watching a professional cornhole tournament on TV instead. We used to think of a hero as a basketball or movie star, but we have taken this time to remember that we can all participate in our community heroically. Our senior year took an abrupt change of course and left us without last hugs and goodbyes to classmates that we would have hoped for. I remember telling my friends, see you after spring break, but a couple weeks later realizing that I would not be seeing them for quite a while. But we are enduring, enduring through a storm of a global pandemic, and we will be stronger because of it. Though we all have more growing to do, take confidence in knowing that you have the foundation it takes to pursue the goals you have set for yourself. The celebrations we all assumed we would be sharing right now are taking place virtually, which makes me thankful that I live in a time where we have technology and video, to video chat with others, even if we cannot gather in public. As we begin to take our next steps into adulting, the class of 2020 is being asked to be more flexible than ever. Our future may involve a rockier path than we once thought, and it is definitely starting a bit off script. Many of us were hoping to be stepping on college campuses soon, but instead are signing up for online orientation and virtual tours. Our flexibility will allow us to persevere through uncertain times and can lead us towards discoveries of newfound interests and perspectives. We will have the ability to see old problems in a new light and provide new and innovative solutions. The future may not always be perfectly clear, but our perks, perseverance and flexibility will allow us to achieve our goals even in uncertainty. These traits will be imperative as we take our next steps into our development, when it will be our time to lead and our time to write history. Congratulations, Class of 2020.